This is Code.org. Let's see what we're doing. Add text to the body. When you start any web lab project, you'll automatically add document type, HTML, header, body tags to a project. When you add content to your project, you'll need to do it between body and body tags because that's where it should be part of the body of your web page. But uh, don't be scared, but I just magicked my way up another site. And what is this site? Well, this is JSBin. It's a place that we can also create web pages. It's sometimes a place that I'll use just to test out different ideas. Look what they give you. This isn't for learning. This is for people who do this as a profession. I mean, it can be for learning, but what you get what I'm saying here, or you might get what I'm trying to say, look, this looks just like what we're doing on code.org. That's because code.org isn't kid stuff. It's the real deal. So here we are. All right. Yep, body and body tags. That's the main part of a web page. That's where basically everything we're going to be doing for these first few lessons goes. All right, write three simple sentences about any topic you would like inside your body tag. I love doing this with my students because they know I write weird stuff. So um, three sentences, then the body tag. And again, in between, so underneath this guy, but before this slashy thing. So line six, I'm going to write, the roof is not on fire. Birds are cool and stuff and today is not the best day of my life oh maybe it is let's say it is today is boom now it's exciting this icon means yep we're going to save the progress on this guy boom and here it appears so and if yours isn't appearing refresh and save compare your work with a neighbor so we're neighbors. I can't see yours. You can see mine. How's it look? Good? I don't know. I bet we're going to keep doing stuff with this on the next part. So uh, yeah, onward. Just make sure it's in between the body and the body tags. One sentence, two sentence, three.